Hey guys, welcome to the new video. I'm very happy to announce the new tweaks that are working on 14.3 newly jailbroken iPhone 12 Pro Max here that is running 14.3 software. Now, I have to say there is, a, there is an important update. You guys can update the uncover uh, jailbreak from 6.0 to 6.0.1. And this one uh, resolves certain issues with the tweaks and the software itself. First one, I'm going through the alphabetical order, is the activator tweak. Now, activator tweak, everybody knows that you can uh, assign certain gestures and certain you know, commands in order to invoke uh, some stuff. For example, you can uh, select, I don't know, what you do with five finger pinch, what happens if you join the Wi-Fi, you can start certain actions. So everybody pretty much knows what Activator does. Uh, officially, it's not uh, updated, but in my case, it works fine. The second tweak is Audio Recorder 10S or XS. Now, this is a paid tweak, very useful tweak for taking quick notes, recording phone calls, recording the environment around you. It's a pretty awesome tweak, has been updated recently for iOS 14 and I highly recommend it. Okay, number three, we have Barmoji. Now, Barmoji is a free tweak awesome little tweak which gives you the option to show those uh, let me just go back and I'm gonna show you pretty quick so Barmoji tweak gives you this awesome little bar down there on the keyboard with additional with additional row of emojis so you can quickly swipe through them you know and and use them so you can select how many emojis you want four five to nine uh, what's going to be the size do you want haptic feedback all sorts of uh, very useful thingies one awesome tweak uh, is also better alarm i've shown it several times it's a paid tweak but it's highly recommended and very very useful tweak recently it was on the discount by nosy flake the developer i'm not sure if this is still going on if if you can try it and see on his twitter account whether it is on and off on or not so you just have simple settings you have alarms you know you can uh, swap the buttons where the stop will be on the top and snooze will be on the bottom. You can disable harder buttons so you cannot disable the alarm with the buttons on the side. You can have smart snooze so every time you hit snooze button the next snooze button will be of less size. And many many other features where you can uh, highlight, you can change the color of the stop button and everything else. So this is, this is the interface I love, so you have the snooze button at the top all, all the way and you have the stop button at the bottom, so oh, it's very, very loud. Now another very important tweak, and I showed this tweak before and many of you asked me uh, when it's gonna come out. So it came out, this is BT Manager Plus, which is Bluetooth Manager Plus, where you can go into the settings and you can change, rename any of your Bluetooth devices, right? So you can change the name, you can confirm bef be before switching. So each one of these you can adjust, especially for those Bluetooth devices which have very generic, very generic names. So this is BT Manager Plus. Another important tweak to me, and I'm guessing for many of you, is Circube, and it works perfectly well on iOS 14.3. So the Circube tweak gives you the option to play the videos on YouTube in the background, and plus you can download them. So there it is, background play playback, you can set the quality on Wi-Fi, set the quality on mobile data, auto replay, you can change the startup play page, and many, many other awesome features. So this is Circube. So recently on Reddit, I've seen that people were asking, can you, can somebody make a, a, a tweak which disables those paste tips? You know, when you paste from app to app, you get this notification here on the top. So the next day we got disable paste tips tweak, which is a free one. And you can download it from the Big Boss repo. It's compatible with iOS 14. So you don't have those annoying, annoying notifications when you uh, copy and paste certain text or something from app to an app. Download Easy. So Download Easy works like a charm on my iPhone 12 Pro Max. So I highly recommend it, paid tweak, and it downloads all sorts of media 
from social media like videos, like uh, uh, photos and everything else. This is Facebook SP no SOR. So it basically means Facebook no sponsors. So there is no, uh, there are not too many things here about the tweak. It just removes the uh, ads in the Facebook app. Pretty useful, works amazingly well. The next week, free one, but really, really amazing. It's Frame, and it has been recently updated as well to iOS 14.3, and this tweak gives you the option to choose live wallpapers, actually not live, video wallpapers, and you can choose any video from your camera roll, or you can record yourself and place it as a, a as a wallpaper, or you can go to the database now, which is something pretty new to me, and you can choose from the catalog, sorry about that. So, in my case, when you choose the wallpaper, when you, you can choose from their database a lot of the wallpapers, I've chosen this one. However, when I click catalog now, it just brings me out of the app, I don't know why. So it's, it's uh, probably a glitch or something, I expect it to be fixed soon. But this is how it looks like. As you can see, you have the wallpaper moving uh, entire time. And also, okay, this is not needed. And also you can see on the lock screen that it's moving all the time. So this is pretty awesome tweak frame. Additionally, we have Messenger No ad Ads. So this one gives you the option to remove all ads from the Messenger, Facebook's Messenger app. So nothing much to show here. You just click on your profile picture in the top left corner and you can invoke those uh, settings. I'm, I'm just gonna show you briefly. So you can have, you see, these are Messenger No Ad settings. You click on it and you can get this menu like no ads, disable read receipts, disable typing indicator, all sorts of useful things that you want to add to your messenger if you are using the messenger app frequently. Now, Perfect Photos is another awesome tweak which gives additional functionality to your Photos app. In my case, what I like about it, I want to delete media completely. Uh, however, this feature does not work still. Officially, this is not updated for iOS uh, 14, but all other features are there. Uh, however, delete media completely works, but there isn't, uh, I, I miss that notification where it tells me whether I'm sure about it that I want to really remove it completely. However, I'm waiting for this to be updated soon. Quit all, great tweak, you all know, so you want to, uh, remove all the apps you see there is a clear button on the top right corner again i would say based on the design that this clear button is not really where it's supposed to be i think it should be a little to the left but again i'm guessing that the developer will update this soon and uh, but currently it works it does the trick so it really you know uh, removes all the apps running in the background now a must have tweak awesome tweak the roadrunner Everybody knows it, perfect tweak. If you are respringing a lot, like I'm doing every single day, and you're listening to music. So when you respring your device, Roadrunner will prevent the uh, playing app to be uh, closed. So for example, let's play something, whatever. Okay, so you can hear it, you can see it. Finally, I got my hands on this beauty iPhone 12 has finally arrived to, to Kuwait where I reside. So this is the model 128 gigabytes black model iPhone 12. So I'm pretty uh, excited to show you what's inside See? this little box. I'm still talking. See it's very thin. So uh, let's let's get into it. What I'm happy about is that the shuffle tweak has been updated recently for iOS 14 where you can set up your, you know, in the settings panel you have these three categories, tweaks, apps and system apps. So I want to have this uh, here on the tip of my fingers so I can easily, easily access. Now silent recorder also works fine for me. So, so this is the tweak which when you start recording your home screen, you don't show that annoying red indicator in the top uh, left corner. So this is, this is pretty useful. So another super cool, awesome tweak is Smart Network 2, recently updated 
for iOS 14. And a uh, big shout out to Elias who uh, gave this tweak to me to show it. So this tweak does all sorts of beautiful things with your network. You can uh, enable protection of your Wi-Fi's. So whenever somebody wants to go in, in your Wi-Fi settings, you can have it. Uh, you can have the Face ID pop up or, or uh, Touch ID pop up. You can boost the Wi-Fi. Wi you can double tap. You can double tap on the Wi-Fi icon on the top right corner to change to mobile. Uh, you can have haptic feedback. You can fully disable the, uh, uh, you know, this one. So it's not disabled only for one uh, for one day, but it's fully disabled. This is one of the things that Smart Network does for you. You can disable background data, turn off data completely when you lock the device, turn off Wi-Fi, all sorts of the smart switch. So you can uh, quickly switch between LTE or 5G data and Wi-Fi in case the Wi-Fi uh, wi signal got, got very uh, low uh, reception. You can put your favorite Wi-Fi's, you can have the safe Bluetooth devices, all sorts of things. Very nice thing is here that uh, you can select which apps you want to receive notification from when you uh, when Wi-Fi disconnects and mobile light data is is uh, consumed. So very nice tweak, very comprehensive tweak. You have all sorts of nice nice things here. Uh, what I like about this, where is this Bluetooth? I will show you something. Okay. So cool feature about Bluetooth, when you hold, press and hold the status bar, like this, you can get the list of Bluetooth devices, your Bluetooth devices, and you can quickly connect to these. So this is pretty awesome, pretty awesome addition to uh, Smart Network 2. So big shout out to the developer and the tweak is pretty awesome. Now additional one is Twitter No Ads. So Twitter no ads does the same like Facebook and Messenger no ads. So you just remove all the ads and additionally in Twitter no ads you remove the fleets, annoying fleets, which I don't like. So let me see and, and, and see how it works because I wasn't sure that it was working properly. Okay, yes, now it works amazingly well. As you can see, now I don't have any, uh, I don't have any fleets up there and I don't have any any uh, ads in my Twitter app. Pretty amazing, pretty cool tweak. Also, I have Velvet here. So Velvet tweak uh, has been updated recently to the iOS 14 to, to support the newest, newest devices. So it basically gives you the fresh new look on your, uh, for your notifications. So for example, in banner, let's see like this, this is how the notification looks like. So it's slightly changed, you can customize them. Right? So this is how it's gonna look from, from WhatsApp, or let's say, I don't know, from something else. Let's say this, from ClickUp, etc., etc. So you can do the same thing for the lock screen notifications. Let's see how they look like. You see these are the notifications, uh, the newly designed notifications in, in Velvet, right? Another tweak without which I cannot live, to be honest, recently is Watusi 2. It's a paid tweak and you have all sorts of customizations in your WhatsApp app. You can increase the privacy, you can freeze the last scene, disable read receipts, disable typing indicators, all sorts of uh, accommodations to the WhatsApp app. And basically I'm using it just, I don't want people to see whether I read their messages or not. You can hide chats, you have many, many different add-ons that, that you can choose from. So what's a, what was it to amazing tweak which works amazingly well on the new software and new jailbreak. Thank you for watching, I hope you liked my, my video and see you in the next one.